So I was asked by Chris Goode, or I guess that's how you pronounce your last name, sorry if I butchered it, man, uh, why I throw with a strap or how do I throw with a strap. So here it is. So if you can tell, this is a really old worn out glove. Um, I've gotten tired of tearing my hands off over and over and over again. And throwing with a strap allows me to get a lot more volume in. And then when I get closer to some games, I'll practice and play with my hook grip to make sure things feel the same. So this glove is literally just worn out and beat up just to protect my skin, mostly right through here, the pads of my hands and fingers. So when I use a strap, I'm just using a lightweight here handle here. All I do is I have the strap on. This is how you should actually use a strap when you're wearing them on your wrist, is that when you cinch it, it comes up between your finger and thumb, your index finger and thumb. And when I'm putting it on the weight, all I do is kind of curl it under once and then grab it. I do not wrap it around there is I just curl it on and grab it once. Let's see if this shows any better. Right, so it's not really wrapped. It's just on there one time, and then I reach over and grab. And I don't wrap it around. And that way, when I release, the strap will release. It works pretty good with the heavy weight, but sometimes with the lightweight, I guess there's not enough force, tension, etc. It'll stick, and it sucks, it's uncomfortable, it can pull you to the ground, literally. Um, it's terrible. You can get hurt. But I go ahead and with the amount of times that that bothers me, it's typically less and sometimes I just have to hold the strap a little looser to let it come go, let go of it. It's, an, it's a toss up, but uh, this is just a quick video, how to throw with the strap.